What's good, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. If it is the first time you're touching down on this channel, welcome to Small Feet, Big Heat. We talk sneakers, we talk streetwear, and everything in between. Today is a highly requested video. Ever since I dropped part one and part two, y'all been asking for this one, and that is where to buy fitted hats, part three. I'm gonna be giving y'all five new fitted hat stores, and when I say new, I don't mean like they're new stores, brand new, you know, opening stores, but they are new because I haven't talked about them before. Part one and part two, I talked about 10 other stores. Make sure y'all go ahead and check out those videos if you haven't already. But this is gonna be part three, so we're gonna talk about five new fitted hat stores. Let's go ahead and jump right in. I don't wanna waste too much time. Like, comment, subscribe, show a small YouTuber some love. Let's get into it. So as y'all can see, I'm going to be doing this video differently than I did the previous two. I'm actually gonna show y'all the websites and the Instagrams for the stores that I'm gonna be talking about on the screen as I talk about them. So the first store that we're gonna get into is Crown Legends. Crown Legends is a new one to me. I wasn't really up on them before, but I am now. And I'm happy that I started paying attention because they've been having some fire drops. Here's one of them. This is the Mud Pat. Just take a look at these hats. That Flying Ball Phillies, that Twins that's in the mix. Crazy. Different color UVs on this collection. You got a Stomper in the mix. They really have great execution. Like it's on par with Capsule Hats. It's on par with Hat Club. They're nice with the color placement. Here is the Ritz collection that they did. I have a hat to unbox from them actually. Might have to do that today so I could go ahead and just show it to y'all already. Here was like a nostalgic Game Boy pack. They've really been dropping some fire and it's been consistent. Here's a Mariners joint that I've actually been looking for. I'm waiting for this one to pop up on eBay Grail something, something. I have been waiting and watching for this Mariners right here. This is on, this is on the Grail list. There's not a lot of hats on the Grail list, but this is one of them. That's that Mariners is crazy. And the website is good. The website's smooth. You can check out easy. You can find what you need easy. Yeah, I know that's a big factor for me. I don't like shopping on websites where, you know, the navigation is trash. It's hard to find what you're looking for. I don't like that. I like clearly being able to see what's sold out, what's available, and what sizes, how much it costs without having to click it, open it up. You know what I'm saying? It's easy to check out on a website. I was done in like less than a minute. Easy, one, two, three. You can sort by new to old. And I will say they don't sell out super fast. Yes, some of the drops are becoming more and more popular, but there's been plenty of times where like I'll oversleep into the drop a little bit, you know, open the page like an hour late and I was still able to check out what I wanted or there were still sizes left, even if it's not my size. Now we're gonna move on to Just Fitteds. I actually purchased a couple hats from Just Fitteds. I'm not gonna tell y'all which ones, I still wanted to be a surprise for the unboxing, but Just Fit is, is another store that I've been tapping into more and more recently because the design work is there. The execution is there. Now this store is located in Germany, so be prepared to pay shipping, pay a little bit extra shipping. I had to pay, I believe it was like 16 and change. So from Germany to New York where I'm at, DHL Express, it was like 16 and change. I don't remember the exact amount, but the hats are almost here. The hats are saying that they'll be here. I'm filming this on Friday. The hats are saying that they'll be here on Sunday. So that's pretty quick. You know, Germany to New York, that's faster than some of the stores that I order from in New York. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So fast shipping is always something that I could get behind. I always really appreciate that. These two hats are actually the drop for today. And normally when Just Fitted's post the hats, that's when they're going live on the website. Sometimes it'll say, oh, available in like one hour and then an hour from then they'll be posted to the site. Or sometimes it'll say, you know, available now, whatever the case may be. I noticed that it's not like a, I'm announcing this so far ahead in advance. With Crown Legends, they usually post early, you know, get people hyped for the weekend, and then the hat will drop that weekend, but they post it a couple days before. With Just Fitted, it seems like he's more so on the wave, or they are more so on the wave of posting the day of when the hat drops. Here's an Astros prototype and a Marlins. These are pretty clean. This one kind of has burger vibes in my opinion. It's Astros right here. Here's a couple of other hats. Sometimes he'll drop, or they, whatever, I, I'm not sure. They'll drop one hat a day, drop four hats, you know, in one day. Like that Phillies joint was three hats in one day. You just never know. So you got to stay up on it, turn your notifications on. Really nice Blue Jays, red UV on that one. Super clean. Real clean. 
The only drawback is that shipping price. Oh, and the website that we're about to talk about. There's a really nice cubbies. So y'all can kind of see the designs that are coming out of Just Fitted's. Definitely some heat. Now we're gonna talk about this website. I don't like the layout of the website. And for me personally, it's just a little hard to find what I'm looking for. Like sometimes I'll go over here, you know, Just Fitted's, boom, New Era, boom. There's nothing there. This is not what I'm looking for, you know what I mean? Like, I'm looking for the hats that you just said we're gonna drop, <laughs> you know? Like, I'm looking for the heat, where is it at? But now if I go to Just Fitted and I go here to custom caps on this banner underneath the other banners, now I'm starting to see a little bit more of what I'm here for, you know what I'm saying? But the two hats that dropped today, if you notice, are still not the first two hats on the website. I like it when what's new is like right at the top because then I don't have to scroll, scroll, scroll. I'm searching, I'm finding. When I had to buy uh, the hats that I bought earlier this week, and again, I'm not going to give it away, I couldn't find them because I wasn't used to shopping on a site. It was my first time shopping on a site that I actually had to go over here and type in what I was looking for, and I found the hats that way. Another thing was the... Uh, the way that they were like added to cart and the way that you check out was different, weird a little bit. Like I had three hats in my cart. I checked out and only two of them went through. And then I went and I double checked to make sure that I did have all three in my cart, but I only two checked out. I was right, only two checked out. So I had to go back, buy the third hat and then pay that $16 shipping again. So that had me kind of hot, but <laughs> it it is what it is. I'm happy that I got all three hats. Um, and that's kind of things that the more you shop with companies, you'll learn to circumvent. So it's not a huge deal. Like the layout of the website, I'll learn the more that I shop. But I would appreciate it if the website was an easier layout. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, the website design is not a deal breaker for me. I still purchase my hats. I think that Just Fitted has great design. Uh, I haven't gotten my hats yet, so I can't say for certain that the shipping was great. But if they arrive when it says that they will arrive, really fast, great shipping, and great prices. The, the hats are not overpriced. Y'all will notice that the hats are in a different, uh, different currency. I would obviously need USD, but the euro and USD is almost equal right now. It's like a couple cents off but it's almost equal. So but that's not a big deal right now. I think the hats are really well priced, especially since they are custom caps. There's a lot of stores that are taxing for custom caps. Um, let's go back to Crown Legends so I could talk about their pricing. They're $60, which I definitely think is on the high end of the spectrum, like all the right. Their hats are also $60, which it's just high. I just think it's high. You know what I'm saying? Hat Club is usually around the 50, 55 mark. And if I'm being honest, I think that's where everybody should be. 60 just seems pushing it to me. 60, I don't know, what, what's the difference between that 55? And, well, I do know what the difference is between 60 and 55. It's $5. And, and apparently, um, yeah, it just makes a lot of difference. But yeah, so Crown Legends, their hats are usually about $60. Just fitted. the hats range around like $44, which I think is a good deal. The next store is Crown Minded, just like Crown Legends and Just Fitted. This is another store that I only recently started to really pay attention to. I like consistency. If you're not gonna drop heat consistently, ain't no point in me paying attention. I buy hats every week. I need for people to be dropping heat consistently. Take my money. <laughs> nah, I'm, I'm joking, but no, nah, I'm serious actually. So uh, here is Crown Minded. I think that they've been dropping a lot of heat recently. Consistent heat. Here is the back to school drop that's happening this weekend. Got to see great off-white crowns. That Texas Rangers, man, that Texas Rangers. They also routinely drop snapbacks. So if you're into snapbacks and not, you know, just fitted hats, Crown Minded will be a good look because they drop a lot of custom snapbacks as well. So here's the alley-oop fitted drop, which was of course very, very popular. That Washington Nationals flu, of course. The Dodgers, Lakers crossover flu. The Supersonics, Seattle Mariners flu. I'm still looking for that uh, Supersonic Seattle Mariners. I think that hat is cold, really nice hat. Yeah, great collection. A lot of people really like that one. Some variety packs that were pretty good. 
Then you had this neon kind of vibe that they did a couple weeks ago. This is dope. Everybody's style is different, but that's what it's all about. You got the Depolitan joints down here. A lot of good collections. A lot of good collections. Now let's take a look at the website and their prices. So we're going to go right over here. MLB, shop all MLB. Now we're going to go over here, change it from best selling to new to old. That's what I want to see. I want to see the new heat first. There's some snapbacks mixed in because like I said, they regularly do snapback drops as well. But as you can see, the fitted hats are $49.95. This one from like a particular collection is $54.95. So I'm okay as long as, you know, I don't cross that 55. Once you cross a 55, I just feel like you're doing too much. So yeah, that's crown minded, good design work, good prices, nice website layout, crown minded. Now we're gonna move on to Capanova USA, which I can't believe that I didn't talk about before. But uh, that's probably because even though I was tapped into Capanova USA before, I didn't like the hats as much. I feel like their more recent designs have been better suited for me. A lot of people like their older stuff, cool, whatever, you know, to each zone. But their newer designs have been better suited for me. I like their newer designs a lot. So I feel like, you know, previously they were dropping stuff like this, you know, like super bright. I felt like some of the patches were a little oversaturated. It wasn't really something that I was prioritizing week after week. That's a good way to say it. With all the heat that's dropping, I wasn't prioritizing capping over USA. Now with their recent drop like this, what was this called? Was this Juneteenth, I believe? Or something like that. One Love. This One Love pack, fire. Like really, really nice, well-executed hats that aren't super, super like loud. You know what I'm saying? Then they had this one right here, which I wasn't crazy about but it's better the editor's choice pack part two these hats were so fire i even started looking at corduroy brims these are corduroy brims if you know from watching the channel i'm not crazy about corduroy this is cherry garcia that's dropping sunday hey it's a lot of good hats i feel like capanova has definitely stepped up their game some may agree some may disagree but that is just my opinion the scooby-doo pack that they did we got to talk about that that was crazy these hats are cold there's bright hats in the mix but they're just really clean well executed hats and that's i feel like the difference that scooby-doo collection was crazy so mad i missed out on that but they also dropped some pirates a while ago that i picked up he was the pirates two-tone drop ICUVs on all of these. I did buy one of these joints. The shipping was super quick, very, very fast. And I'm always happy about that. We're gonna go ahead and jump over to the website now. They're promoting their Cherry Garcia, which again drops on Sunday. I don't know when y'all are watching this, but yeah, that drops on Sunday. Let's go to uh, new arrivals. Really easy, you know exactly where to go. This is what I like to see. Clean layout. I can see all of the hats, all of the prices. Click, grab my size, add the cart. Boom, boom, boom. No blown up pictures blocking the add the cart button. No blown up pictures blocking the, the, the buttons and just taking up the screen. None of that. It's just clean website, clean layout. And Kappa Nova, some of the drops do sell out very quickly. Like that editor's choice, if you can see, like that's gone. The Pirates from the two-tone icy drop are gone. But there is still collections like this vault, like tennis ball collection that they did that are still there. These khaki hats, some of them are still there. These other bright hats that they did, some of them are still there. So it's not a website that I would say sells out super, super quick, but if you know something is hyped up, there's gonna be a lot of people on the website, don't sleep, you know, jump on, get what you want. The only drawback, and this is just me, to other people, other people might not care. 55, 60, what's the difference? The hats are $59.99, which I can see. All of these custom caps right here, $59.99. Let's go back to the first page, so you can see it on there as well. $59.99, $59.99. But I will say, Capano would be sending me emails about hella sales. So I don't know if these hats are included in the sales or if it'd be other hats on the website, but they do be e emailing me about hella sales. The last store, the fifth store we're gonna talk about today is USA Cap King. It's USA Cap King Inc. on Instagram and the website URL, I just believe is usacapking.com. This website, if I had to compare it to anything so y'all could kind of get the vibes for you caps, I would compare like, 
USA Cap King to like Cap USA Harlem and For You Caps. You can find gems and a lot of the collections when they do them are good, but the consistency of like when they put stuff out and like how much gets put out doesn't really seem to be there. Like if you buy caps every week, you probably won't be buying caps from them every week because it's not a collection every week. They might There's some weeks where you don't even see like a new hat or it might just be like a basic traditional hat. It might not be a custom cap, you know, things like that. It might just be one hat. It might just be like a restock of one team, like this restock right here for the Yankees. So this is Yankees hats and a bunch of different colors that were added to the website. You know what I mean? It's definitely a for you caps kind of when we post the pictures, that's when the hats are available, not announced in advance really type of thing, unless they do a collection like these red and black two-tone joints. So this was drops Friday the 19th. It was announced in advance. So people had time to see if that's what they wanted to, to grab that week. Here was an off-white crown collection that they did. This was also announced in advance. You can definitely find some gems if you're paying attention. So I would just, you know, follow them, turn on notifications if you want. Check the website occasionally. There might be, you know, some leftovers worth checking out. Here's the website. Not a big fan of the website, but um, I also don't like the For You Caps website. So that's kind of funny. Uh, here are the hats, some of the hats. I do like that it clearly says what's sold out, though. I don't have to like scroll over it or anything like that. They do have quick view, which is nice. And the prices are good at USA Cap King as well. If you enjoyed today's video, remember to like, comment, subscribe, show us more YouTubers some love. It helps the channel grow, helps the videos get out there in the algorithm so that more people can find the channel. And I will check y'all out in the next one.